Mystery divers rescued near Polish energy sites in the middle of the night offer dubious explanation, and vanish. Here's a summary of the article. Coast guards rescued three divers off the northern coast of Poland over the weekend whose dubious explanation of their nighttime dive near critical energy infrastructure, along with their mysterious identities, has reportedly sparked a cross-agency investigation. The three men, who told authorities they were Spanish nationals, were rescued by lifeguards near the Polish coastal city of Gdańsk on Saturday night after their small motorboat broke down and they couldn't return to shore. According to Polish media reports, only one of the men had a Spanish passport, while the others offered only verbal identification. Seasoned amber hunters interviewed by Polish media said one more thing didn't add up. The men had an underwater scooter, used to drag divers swiftly through the water, something that wouldn't help in a hunt for small objects on the seafloor, especially as such a device's propeller lifts debris from the bottom, decreasing visibility. Officers apparently saw nothing suspicious at first in the fact that the men were diving near critical infrastructure at night with no permit and atypical amber hunting equipment, and the local police did not pursue the matter, releasing the men without further questioning. Cesare Prispiorka, deputy captain of the port of Gdańsk, told Polish media that only one of the men had formal identification, and the phone numbers offered by the divers were either incorrect or non-functional. The incident has raised serious concerns about the protection of vital national energy infrastructure as Russia's ongoing war in Ukraine continues to keep energy prices sky high. This post received a score of 40,000, with an up-vote ratio of 95%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. It was idiotic to let them go. Looks like a brainless person took this decision. Edit. Or. A person who knew what's going on. Greater than officers apparently saw nothing suspicious at first in the fact that the men were diving near critical infrastructure at night with no permit and atypical amber hunting equipment, and the local police did not pursue the matter, releasing the men without further questioning. As a professional diver, most people are completely clueless to normal dive practices. You can tell them whatever edit, typo. I feel like the dive practices, equipment is way less relevant than where they were with the whole why did you let them leave? But yay, as of most people, I'm completely clueless and you could say anything you wanted to me. We use C4 and cartoonishly silly dynamite to breath underwater. I also always keep a Russian nuclear submarine nearby JIC I need backup for a particularly nasty tuna. Greater than nuclear submarine, yay. Such a great sandwich, dude who let them go. Such a mystery that might never be solved. Much like the question of who blew up the Nord Stream pipeline, I guess. Who did it anyway? The guys were from Spain. They said they were collecting amber, all in state of the art diving equipment. And only one of them had a Spanish passport and none of them provided correct contact information? Just your average, middle of winter, nighttime, Spanish amber hunters operating in Polish waters without any documents or contact information. Nothing to see here. Edit, to the guy. Missing my towel? Morning that skeptics of the diver's story are conspiracy theorists, jog on mate. Read the article before replying to everyone so arrogantly. The Polish PM wants a comprehensive report on the incident. Guess he's a conspiracy theorist? Two. I just quickly searched Google and I'm surprised to learn two things. The Polish coastline has abundant sources of amber. It's easier to hunt amber at night when it's much darker because when light hits it in the dark it shines like the sun. There's loads of YouTube videos about amber night hunting. Or it was a very detailed excuse that local cops might believe. Because it sounds like it may not be the first time they've encountered late night underwater amber hunters. They were diving very close to a critical energy facility for Poland. They had a high-tech underwater scooter with them, which is said to be useless for amber hunting according to the experts, since it kicks up too much sand and moves too fast to allow you to effectively scour the seabed. When all the facts are laid out, it seems to still be a pretty implausible story. It's also hard to overlook the fact we just so happen to be in a de facto war with the closest foreign land to where the divers were found. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.